In this video, we're going to talk about three muscles that can cause you some pain, some back problems, and just overall stiffness. Okay, let's start with the first muscle that can cause you pain and kind of pull your back out of alignment if it is not stretched properly. And that we'll just kind of, kind of generally call it the glute muscles, right? So the butt. When the butt is tight from sitting on it all day, from driving, uh, whatever you do, um, it can really pull our lower back out of alignment. So the glute muscles, if you have a foam roller, I like a uh, foam roller. I was introduced to this uh, by my colleague and friend, Elena Holden, who um, I'll, I'll show you in just a second her, her favorite way to use it. So the you can just simply sit on your foam roller, put your legs back or your arms back and your legs and just roll out those glutes okay so depending on how much you weigh this could be a little bit painful or you could just maybe not even feel it and it can go to one side and there's these little itsy bitsy muscles called the glute medius muscles that are usually a culprit in that so those ones you're gonna roll and just kind of hold just kind of hold. You can also put your leg up like this. It kind of gets into that side a little bit deeper and you can feel that really well. Okay, so that's the glute muscles and that's something that really should be stretched, rolled and released. So it's like giving your body a little bit of a massage there. Okay, so the second muscle that that can really bother us is the hip flexors, right? So the hip flexors help us to flex our hip. And a lot of times we're sitting all day and they just get very, very tight. They attach here from the fever, femur up through the low spine, the low back, the lumbar area here. So it goes actually goes through the pelvis. And we found that actually massaging in the belly sometimes is beneficial for that. But something we can just simply do is a simple stretch, runner stretch, you've heard of it, where we're just tilt, tilting the pelvis and stretching that. We can do it standing. We're just tilting. And if you want to bring your arms up and over, I've done a video on this previously. And the other side. We're just doing that. So that's going to help stretch the hip flexors. The third muscle that I want to talk about is this IT band, we call it. Okay, so it attaches up here in our, our femur, kind of like our hip, and all the way through here, kind of down to the knee. And what happens is when it's very tight, it can really cause problems with the knee. It can cause problems with our back and really throw us out. And I would guess if any of you walk or you sit a lot all day or you're athletic at all, you'll push on this and it'll be kind of tight. So this will be one of your tightest muscles. And a, a simple IT band stretch is just to the side here. Oh, and then stretching my arm up. Okay, but this can be just a simple IT band stretch. But if you'd like to do the roll in the release, oh boy, <laughs> this is where you really can dig in. Okay, so I'm on my side. And, oh, and I'm just going to hold this. My friend Elena introduced me to this. I'm just holding those little kind of trigger points, those tight areas. I mean, it could almost bring it you to tears. I'm holding my weight up with my arm here. I've got a little weight in this leg that's crossed over. Some people put both legs out. Oh my goodness. But you can just roll that back and forth all the way up, kind of the side. Oh, 
not on the knee. Go close. Ooh, you could go a little further and get a little bit into the quad as well. So keeping those three muscles stretched, keeping those three muscles free of those trigger points really can help your low back, your knees, your body just be in such a better, better shape. I hope this video was helpful to you. Please go ahead and like this video if it was helpful for you. Let me know down in the comments which one of those three muscles is tight on you. I'd love to know. And please subscribe to our channel so you get more of these great little health, fitness, chiropractic tips that can help you have a healthier and happier day-to-day -day life. Thanks.